and welcome back to Metroid Dread. Hey everyone, how y'all doing? And welcome on back. Where last we left off, we took down our first Emmy, we got the Spider Magnet. And now it's time to take on our first boss. Like our first major story related boss. Okay. <laughs> this door. This door has fucked me up so many times. I want to see if I can at least get it. First try, baby. Alright. Now to actually focus. Chozo architecture. It's Corpus! That's, that's the name of the boss. Let's go, baby. Ow. Okay, not going well. It's been a hot minute since I last fought Corpus. So now he's gonna go invisible. There it goes. Here's the four. Just try to aim for his tail. Oh, he's angry. Where'd he go? Oh, he's gonna hit us with his tail! But wait! Ooh. See him then? This is cool! I keep shooting the missile. Gonna come on back. Directly for a stupid little head. Oh, whoop. Thought he was gonna. Fuck! out of this corner. It's not good. There we go. That was an awful corpus fight. That was awful. He wouldn't get me out of the corner. That was really bad. Still standing. Come on, man. Boom. Yeah, baby, she's back, badass. Sam, this is back, baby. We get this tail. It was a Q. And we get access to the Phantom Cloak. What's the Phantom Cloak do? Upgrading suit for Aeon compatibility. Phantom Cloak, an Aeon ability that renders Samus into the world of enemies by refracting light. She can also move silently, albeit at a slower speed. With full Aeon, press the right stick to activate, and press the right stick once again to deactivate. Aeon will be slowly consumed while this ability is activated. Moving or firing weapons while activated will consume additional Aeon. 
Once all Eon has been depleted, the Phantom Cloak will consume energy instead. Should it deplete energy to 1, it will automatically de deactivate. After deactivation, Aeon will begin to recharge automatically when Samus makes any actions. The ability cannot be activated again until the Aeon is full. Nice. Now we have access to a new ability. Oh, we can't head back through there. So here's how it works. If you see these three doors, they won't let us through if they detect something near it, so we gotta sneak past. Condition, we'll ride this all the way up here. Save our progress here. Alright, rather short episode, but I want to save these episodes to take care of bosses, so... Um, that would probably put Colacus at like 36 minutes, right? Most. 3550. Not too bad of a Corpus fight, I guess. Um, next episode should be the last one that I do for this series, at least for a while, until I feel like picking it back up again in the future at some point. And next episode will have us taking care of a little bit of Kataris. I think Kataris is like the next area if I remember Metroid Trick correctly. And then we'll also get the Morphal. So stay tuned for that. Should be, uh, should be pretty cool. And I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.